Hey guys, it's me, Uncle Chris, Uncle Chief. <laughs> uh, guys, in this short tutorial, I'm going to show you some cool app and phone school, school timetable, mainly for students and those still at campus, mainly. So, with those few words, let's go inside the app and see. Click the icon. So I had already created some timetable. I'm going to go ahead and click it. Yes. Let's go this side. I'm going to show you don't get scared. I'm going to delete it. So on Monday. So this app you can go and set a day you want but for this case I'm going to leave it on Monday and they're saying no tables yet so click this red plus button so on Monday they tell you you can either set the day you want but for this case I will leave Monday they tell you provide the subject store course code and I'm doing computer science so our course code is SD for this subject I'm writing SD50 and CSD in full is computer science department and the course title is business systems analysis business systems analysis so you be asked to provide the time it starts so we start at one sorry I'm first going to go back in time we start at 1 p.m. around 1 15 place ok so the time when it's ending end time so it ends at 5 5 30 so they will ask you the lecturer's name so this is Miss Christine. Miss Christine, the lect lecture venue. So where you're going to hold that classroom from, and ours is always the next C, next C block. Sorry. So you go ahead and save your day. Do you want to save this data? Click yes. So you will see our days automatically build in. The time you start and when it ends, the code, course code, and the course title. Let us click on it and see. They tell you the course code is CSD50. Course title is Business Systems Analysis. Lecturer's name is Miss Christine. The lecture venue is next, next C block. The, star, the time when it starts and when it ends. If you made any mistakes in writing your data, you can always update it. But for now, our data is correct. You can leave it there. Or in case you finish to do that subject and you still have it in your table, you can click it. There is this in the right corner. Upper corner there is the delete button. Do you want to delete this data or details? For this case, I'll say no because I still need it. That's how you can do it. You can go always put other codes. 60. Repair and maintenance. Repair and maintenance. Starting time. We start at 10 a.m. So we end at 2. 2. PM, lecturer's name, Mr. Mude, lecture avenue, Jubilee, Jubilee Hall. So go ahead and save your day. So I hope you're getting to see how things move. All these subjects on Monday, I can go ahead and create for Tuesday. So the next cool thing about this app is you can always grade yourself even before getting the marks. 
So I see in the right upper corner those three dots. Click there. So press commit. So here you can store your score results you got in Sublix. So click this plus red button. Press add. So they ask you to enter the subject. I'll say HTML. I score 95 click save and you automatically they will grade you according to your max or results HTML score 95 you in grade A so you can go on doing like that CSS 85 click save CSS 85 grade A that's it let's see in case you fail the paper I'll put PHP 25 save automatically they will give you grade F I guess you're seeing how this app is useful to a student you is still at school you can engage with it so the next cool thing about this app is the reminder it can always remind you I seeing this bell somewhere in the right upper corner click that bell so I'm going to add the reminder the reminder is going to be alert me I run title details I'm going to stop recording this video so Matter will tell you to set the date. Some um, we end. Um, it's Saturday, April first. Happy Fool's Day, by the way. So I'm going to click OK. Set the time. Right in the upper corner, you're seeing the time is 10 past 53. I'm going to. So I'm going to put mine on 54. 54 a.m. Click save. Yes, save. So I'm going to exit the app so that we able to see. Uh, are you seeing the reminder? It's going to say the reminder. The reminder is called Alert Me. Are you seeing it up? I'm going to click it. The reminder is there. And it's Alert Me. I'm going to stop recording this video. So I hope you have liked the video. I'm going to leave the download link in the description below like the video subscribe share with your friends and enjoy this co-op until next time thank you